Yo, what's good, basketball heads? It's your boy Crush. So Kevin Garnett thinks Anthony Davis is going to win MVP soon. Tell me. How? You when? In order to win MVP, that. you got to be available. You got to be a monster throughout the season. You can't play good a few games, then you're off again, then you're good a few games, then you're injured. I mean... I'm not wishing bad on Anthony Davis. I just don't know how is he going to win MVP. Like, that's not an easy thing to win. You got to be consistent to win MVP. You got to be available. So Kevin Garnett saying AD is going to win MVP soon. That's a big cap. I'm sorry. I don't see it. I mean, I get it. KG is trying to motivate Anthony Davis. And it's a good look from one big man to another. He's trying to motivate him. And I respect it. But AD has to motivate himself. You got to want to win MVP for yourself. Nothing is wrong with someone else pushing you to do something. That's great. But you got to want to win for yourself. So if AD don't want to win MVP, KG could say whatever he wants or thinks, it won't matter. You could say AD is just as skilled as Nikola Jokic or better. If you want to say all that, but guess what? We need to see it on the court, not in flashes, but cons- you know, consistency. That's the one thing Jokic have over a lot of these big men. He's consistent every game, every night, most games. So he's very consistent. AD drifts, he comes and goes. He's motivated some games, other games he's unmotivated. And you can't win MVP with that mindset or that characteristic. No, you have to be motivated all the time. You know, you got to want to be the best big man in the league, on the floor, period. There's no in-between. So until AD get this mindset, I don't see how he's going to win MVP. Anthony Davis is 10 years in, and he has yet to live up to his potential, his full potential at least. Have you seen the best of AD, like, yet? No, you haven't. He was great in the bubble, don't get me wrong, but was that his best? I don't, I, no, I don't think so. The skill set AD have and the talent, you probably will never see AD maximize his talent because of his mindset. That's the first step, mindset. KG had that mindset. He wanted to be the best, even if talent-wise, he wasn't the best. He was great, one of my favorite players. But even if KG didn't have all the talent, mindset, and his mindset is what propelled him. Anthony Davis don't have that mindset. So even though the talent is there and we keep saying the same thing year after year because we know how great he is talent-wise, if mentally you're not there, it don't matter. It don't matter. So this is what Kevin Garnett had to say about Anthony Davis. I'm expecting Anthony Davis to be the MVP in the next two years or something. You can't let the Joker come in the league and surpass you. Nah. Anthony Davis can do everything Nikola can do. He can do everything Embiid can do. The F you talking about, bro. I am expecting him to be MVP. If not this year, definitely next year. Sounds nice, but it's not happening. AD don't have the motor to be MVP. Like I said again, you got to be a monster all season for more than 65 games. That's just the fact of the matter. And AD drifts, you know, he might play 10 good games, then he have six, seven off games. That's the way AD is. He comes and goes, comes and goes. I hear what Kevin Garnett is saying. We all do. We all know how talented AD is. We know this, but when it's time for basketball, he drifts, man. He's always drifting. And it's always been like this. So I don't know. Well, I don't see him winning MVP. Maybe he could prove me wrong, and I would love to see that because AD should be an MVP at least one season. Come on, man. This guy is too talented. We know he's a great defender. He's a great offensive player. We know his skill set, man. The dude has game, but when it's time to make that translate, it just drifts like last season in the playoff. The man made Nicola destroy him. Nicola destroyed Anthony Davis. Like, Easy work. It should never be like this. Never. If anything, it should be a question. Who's better? It shouldn't be, man, Joker destroyed him, but 
whenever AD play big men, great big men, not the not subpar, you know, but whenever he play Embiid, Giannis, Nikola, he shrinks for some reason instead of rising to the occasion, which he did once against Embiid. One time AD outplayed Embiid. In the past year plus one time, he outplayed Embiid. Normally he shrinks. He plays Embiid, he plays Joker, he plays Giannis, and you're like, where's AD? But if he plays someone else that's inferior to his talent, then you'll see MVP AD like, oh, there he goes. And that's whack, man. You're supposed to want to get up for the best players in the league. That's what makes you the best. You're supposed to get up for the players on your level. That's just what it is. Whenever you play players on your level, on your tier, That should force you to get up to want to play. Like, let's go. I don't see that from AD, and I've watched him enough, and I don't see that. He only get up against scrubs. I'm sorry, I'm calling the truth. He only get up against lesser players. I'm calling it for what it is, because I've seen it. Only once I've seen AD outplay Embiid. One time. AD is very comparable to Garnett. Both long, lanky. Garnett might be a a snitch taller. Both two-way players. AD is a great defender. Garnett is a great defender. AD is a great offensive player. Garnett was a very good offensive player. So they're very similar. The only and the main difference is Garnett is very aggressive. His mindset, he has a killer mentality. He's aggressive. That's where they defer. AD is a total opposite on the other end of the pole. Total opposite. So that's where they defer, basically. So if AD could develop a Garnett mindset, He would be a monster. And maybe that's what he needs to do or try to do so they could win a championship. Because clearly the Lakers believe in him. They think he could win a championship. I don't think so, but Rob Palenka, the front office, Genie Buss, they think LeBron and AD could still win. I don't believe it, but hey, I might be wrong. Who knows? So last season, Davis averaged 26.8 points, 14 rebounds. 2.8 2.8 blocks in the 2023 Western Conference Finals. But he got dominated by Nikola Jokic. So he balled out until he ran into the Joker. And it was over. Game over. Because like I said, he don't get up versus big man who's on his level. He don't. So I expect AD and the Lakers to come back with a vengeance this season. For the 2024 season. Mainly AD. I expect AD to return with a vengeance. After the way the Joker did him and the big extension the Lakers gave him, that boy better ball out for 2024. But we'll see what happened, man. But as always, I'll holla. As always, we just talking basketball. Hit the subscribe button, like, comment, share, holla at your boy. It's all about the game and how you play it. It's all about the game. I'ma say it. It's all about the game.